why do teams of startups with uh, very smart people fail? Now, this is not a very common question, uh, especially if you're looking at individual contributor roles, but you could probably be asked this question if uh, you're going into consulting and almost definitely you can get a question like this if you're applying to leadership positions. Now, in my opinion, uh, there are many reasons why a team could fail. And uh, one of the reasons uh, could probably be wrong timing. So you have a great product, but the timing was not great, or you don't have a very good product, or uh, you know your business model is not great. So you have a great product, perfect timing, but you know your business model is not great. But in in my opinion, uh, the biggest reason for why a lot of uh, teams and startups with extremely smart people fail is. Uh, a lack of empathy towards the customer and not looking at the problem from a customer perspective. So, uh, and, and how you could solve this is to inculcate the user experience mindset from the start. So what uh, a lot of startups that do not succeed, what they do is we're a bunch of smart people, we're going to build this product or we're going to design the service. And because we can use it, we think everyone can use it. And instead of designing a product for the average customer, they end up designing a product that is best for themselves. So, uh, uh, and you know, the result of, of something like this is uh, failure of the team or uh, of, of the company. So the best way to avoid this is to inculcate a user experience mindset and to think of the problem, which is your product or your service or anything else that you or anything else that you that you that you're building from a customer mindset so develop a customer first mindset when um, developing a team or developing uh, a product